Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data scientist or a data analyst, then cracking the SQL into is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, I'm Alvi Prasad. I'm a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in top companies which are available at the LeetCode platform. All my code solutions for the questions available in LeetCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chat description below. And also, in addition to that, I have segregated the channel into five playlists, namely easy, medium and hard, depending upon the difficulty of the question. The premium level subscription question of LeetCode as premium playlist and I combined all the 230 questions into one single playlist as all SQL order. Now let's see the question which you are trying to solve it. It's type medium, question number 2292, products with three or more orders in two consecutive years. Okay, let's see the question in action. It is already asked in Amazon for one to two years. They have given a table. Write an SQL query to report the IDs of all products that were ordered three or more times in two consecutive years. Okay. Return the table in an order. Okay. Let's see this. If you see here, product ID 1 is there 6 times, product ID 2 is there 6 times, okay. And they have made 6 orders, if you see, this is 2020, 2020, 2020, okay. Number of orders is 3. Similarly, this is 2021, 2021, and 2021. This is also having 3 orders. If you see for 2, this is 2022, so not at all. Okay, it is valid, but it is only there one time. So if you see, only first product has two years which are consecutive and have products greater than or equal to three. So first, what we will what we'll do is, let's group by product ID and year of purchase date and filter out for only things which are greater than or equal to three. Let's see that first. From orders, group by product id product id comma year of purchase date okay now select this uh, product id comma year of purchase date Let's call it something y1, comma, count of rows. Okay, let's see it. Check the manual of the near order. Okay, it should be order stable. If you see 1 has 3, 1 has 3 and 2 has 1. But we want only 3 as condition. Let's keep having count of star greater than or equal to 3. Okay. We got it right. Now what we need to do? We got only years which are having 3. Now what we need to do is let's do lag operation for each product ID and year. Okay. And let's see wherever the difference is 1, it is consecutive. Let's call it as some CTE. Now from CTE, select all the rows, all the rows, comma, lag function lag what y1 over partition by product id here one only it is there but in the other test cases other things also can be there product id order by y1 ascending let's call it something uh, 
y2 okay here you can see 2020 nothing is there 2021 20 is there now what we need to do let's call it something ct2 now from this ct2 where y1 minus y2 equal to 1 we want that only select other rows see only one product is there so you want only product id column okay our solution has been accepted let's see the submission okay there is an error what is the error if you see 6 8 we are getting 6 triple 8 means there can be multiple things which are matching that so we will keep only distinct okay our solution has been accepted by the platform thanks for watching my video if you want more detailed explanations like this with code written just subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends and colleagues who are preparing for an SQL round in the data analyst or a data scientist interview or a business analyst it will be grateful be greatly helpful for them and to you also and uh, finally keep practicing and try to complete all the 230 questions you will be to able to solve any question which are asked in the interview thanks for watching